Hi guys, it's Mr. Cube here, and today I'll be um, playing a Asaya build. So today's build is going to be um, Asaya with Polar Vortex and Seeking Storm. And as you can see here, I've um, already completed my full Asaya set, except for the um, Asaya mask. And the reason I chose um, Polar Vortex and Seeking Storm is because um, they uh, they work really well at um, dealing tons of damage. And if you disagree by saying, um, say, Deep Freeze will do way more damage than um, Polar Vortex, well, you're correct, but. Uh, with Polar Vortex, you can actually um, keep a safe distance while dealing the damage. And if you use um, Deep Freeze, you have to uh, go near the enemy to deal the damage. And um, if you can keep your distance, you can actually use Polar Vortex to um, uh, kill Deep Freeze um, players. And... Uh, with Polar Vortex, you can actually um, hide the close-ranged uh, primals like Jinx and Torden, who can't get to you as fast as maybe uh, Sunder. But sometimes you can also do pretty well against Sunders. Um, and I'm going to use Seeking Storm because uh, my stillness level is um, pretty low. Still level five, which only gives um thirty seven percent uh minus thirty seven percent slow. So um the the slow doesn't actually feel good right now, and I'll still need to level it up first before um it can uh, perform better. And uh I don't use the shiver shroud because um I'm taking advantage of seeking storms damage not the uh, not the shield from shiver shroud and uh, well most of the time you can um, usually die when you try to solo an imperial with Isaya but with this build you can actually um, kill it most of the time and uh, vortexes have um, two charges so you can stack them and then they can deal like a whole lot of damage to the Imperial. And uh, you should try like getting a Mechanot buff before um, doing this because uh, in my experience um, when I don't have the Mechanot buff I usually die alongside with the Imperial but with a Mechanot buff I can actually um, kill the Imperial and, and have like half of my health left and that's why um today i'll be using my confusion constant dispatch uh volatile mine and nihilium guard build because with this i have double primalist and so i can cycle my vortexes faster because um when i tried playing uh without double primalist um the DPS goes down by a lot because of um how uh how fast you can cycle the polar vortexes with um double primals. So uh let's just drop into a match. Okay, we're in. You are the one to rise. Okay. The time is now. Your enemy so, has acquired great power. It's I think it's still early game. So we'll just go collect some uh shards. And there's still one Imperial, good. Okay, we'll try and take that later after we get our final. Okay. Oh, that was an enemy beside. Okay, yep, nice. Are we used? Okay. 
so it's uh it's um thing uh arena so yes yeah, still early game okay let's try to take the uh central fortress while the other peeps are in arena And also taking down this guardian is going to give us a large primal pickup. See? Okay. So 60 more seconds and we can take on the Imperial. I really love this um Asaya build because it can uh take care of Imperials really well. Uh unlike most of the Asaya builds that just die. And it's also a really good crowd control without um having to like bomb on the enemy okay i think our reeves is just going to find me i don't know all right let's find it okay with the um double primalist i can um cycle my uh vortex is really fast making it um easier to uh Kill um like Imperials and Dreadnoughts and uh the other stuff. And unlike Deep Freeze, um when you're facing the overseer you can actually attack it like from range, like maybe behind a pillar. Cause um you can uh use the um vortexes from afar. And the overseer is um, really slow, so it won't get too far away from the vortexes. And also, um, the seeking storm really helps. Like, if you can level up um, a bit higher, uh, it can deal some pretty nice damage. And at max level, it can actually deal more damage than Isaiah's basic attack, I'm, I think. I don't know. Okay. And also, mines are really helpful for killing um, large hordes of hunters. Okay, let's do this. Okay. After this, maybe we can try and get the overseer. Okay. They will wait for that outpost to be captured. There we go. Okay. Now let's see, will anyone come and help us? Okay. So when fighting Overseer, you want to get it to half health first because um, the Overseer uh, becomes immune at, at half health and also summons um, the uh, its minions. But it only can it can only do this once in a lifetime. So um. You have to try and make sure if either if it does have it or not. Okay, our Reeves is helping us. That's nice. You can see it's um doing the shield thingy. Okay. So we got some pretty nice help here. Okay, let's prime it. Okay, see we could um attack from behind this column, and it'll still get hit. Okay, done. Okay, we killed that guy. But I'm afraid we'll have to lose the um wild search. But like wild search only gives us like uh around two K points and the overseer gives five K so it's pretty worth it. And it seems like someone's Primarily in the wild search um, outpost. So we are, uh, but uh, the enemy also primal, so I don't think we'll be able to get it. Yep, wild search defeat. But it's okay to um, use a fight to win the war, I think. That's how the uh, quote goes. Or maybe it was some um, battle. I don't know. Okay, let's try and get the um, 
uh, a Meganaut for the damage buff. Okay, there's a keeper. Okay, hello, Meganaut. Um, to play. We got the mega now. So, someone captured this outpost. Oh, there's a golden thing. Okay, looks like we might be needed at the core behemoth place. I don't know if from any of my teammates are there, but it seems like yeah, they are. It seems. Do we need the primer here? See, the vortex are killing the James, like literally. Bro. Okay. He died. Die. Oh, where did he go? Did he escape? Oh no, he's dead there. He's there. Okay. Finally, I'm. Um, a paragon, I gotta, I gotta run. Sorry, mate. Back to dust. Take what remains. Okay. Okay, let's go then. Okay. Just need to kill a few more. There was one, but we ran out of... Ah, oh, there we go, have the ammo. Nice, I think he's using shotgun, so we'll have the advantage if we go from range. Okay, he ran away. Okay, nice. Now, we could go get ourselves a Dreadnought. Oh. It's almost final harvest, so let's just wrap this up quickly. Get the dreadnought. Everyone gets primal on our team, and get okay, that. Go. Go dreadnought. Nice. Escape. Okay. The bastion of eventide. You can have it all. Hold your ground. Mm, let's get you to our outpost and, and do the shards because we can't teleport with the shards, and it will be a bother to have to run from here to there and stuff. Okay. Okay. Where did everybody go? Okay, we'll try and capture this outpost. Okay, there we go. An outpost is yours. One second. You can have it all. Hold your ground. Okay. Let's get this one. Then, then. Oh, someone's attacking the sentry fortress with a primer. But we got a primer on our team too, so let's see if they need our assistance. No. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, they was attacking pretty tanky. Okay. We lost an outpost, we have to get another one. Are you exhausted? Find resolve. Okay. 
Yes. There's a mushroom to the top of the You can have it all. Hold your ground. You falter. Stand and fight. If you could um, attack from range, uh, Vortex is actually really good at countering Deep Freeze Isaiah, because Deep Freeze Isaiah um is better uh close range, but we um win the long range fight. Okay, we're ramping. Defense a kill. Well. I didn't actually expect myself to get Pensa kill. Oh. I'm not really much of a um uh player versus player duel thing. I'm more of an objective taker. Like my playstyle. So yeah. Okay, I think we're pretty tanky here. We got the kill streak buff and the oh damn the enemy got um the fortress. Okay. Okay. Seems like there's a raid here. Pencil killed again. Wow. Wasn't planning that, but turns out well. Okay. Oh, our health is really low. Okay, we got the central fortress. GG. Okay. Double kill. Double kill. Okay. We're giving the enemy a pretty hard time here. This guy is trying to um use the jump pad but he got uh the jump pad bug and the jump pad didn't activate. I wonder when they'll fix the bug though. And then and down. Okay. I wanna try and beat our reef squad. That'd be pretty nice, mm, but I, I have to get like 200,000 2, score, and I wonder if I can get that with um. Okay, we're gonna get. Oh damn! Oh, the guy is um. The guy had the new people. So yeah, it was pretty. It was pretty thick as hell. Okay. A team one, nice. Okay, we got uh second place, but we did have um the higher score for me. But okay, GG, R Reeves, Severus, Sikuyung, and bots or players using bot names. Okay. Okay, continue. Uh, Okay. Okay, so I think that that'll be the end of today's video. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like and comment. And see you on my next video. Bye.